Since we've been at the Oldham County Health Department's drive through vaccine clinic, lines here have been steady, but health officials tell me this has not been the case. They've actually been having a hard time filling up these vaccine appointments. I had gotten sick from this, and I'm telling you, it was horrible. Tina Burke says after contracting COVID-19, she wanted to make sure she never got the virus again. After looking everywhere for a vaccine appointment, the only place she found with openings was the Oldham County Health Department. As soon as I found one, I was like, oh, I'm taking this. But the amount of open appointments here is causing concern. This is a situation where we knew we would transition to at some point uh, because we knew that uh, ultimately, we would get more vaccine, production would ramp up, and then we would have to begin encouraging. The department was dedicating the weekly 200 doses they got to high-risk populations. Now receiving 1,000 doses a week, the department is opening eligibility to all Kentucky residents 18 and over to use the vaccines they have and hopefully keep this drive through clinic parking lot full. The vaccine simply stated does no good in freezers and or refrigerators. We need to get it injected into people's arms. The open eligibility is why Preston Money came to the health department today. He's 18 and it's the first day those his age and older can get their shot. He didn't waste any time rolling up his sleeve. I want to get back to normal just like everybody else. And right now the only way to do that is if you get the vaccination. Burke agrees, saying she hopes her fellow community members take advantage of the open appointments so they can come closer to seeing what normal life after the pandemic will look like. None of us really realize what that is again. I mean, it's been so long since we've had a regular routine that it's going to be good for us to be able to get back to doing regular things. To get a COVID-19 vaccination at the Oldham County Health Department, you can visit their website. In Oldham County, Gladys Bautista, WLKY News.